Hey loser, how does it feel to lose another channel, Darius Truxton, aka Keith Wellwood? Ah, <laughs> what happened to your Yoshi channel? And even you, Yoshi, for a stolen line from OEB Pete. How does that feel, Darius? You lost another channel, you loser. You're always gonna lose. You're always will be a loser. You will never, never be a winner, my friend. Never. You are the biggest piece of trash that the world has ever seen. And it shows because you just keep losing channel after channel after channel. You thought you had it all figured out this time, didn't you? You're like, oh, I'm going to just, oh, I'm going to have nothing associated with Darius Truxton. I'm just going to have a Yoshi avatar because I'm so cool. And uh, yeah, oh, I'm going to use a Yoshi avatar because I proposed to Ursha Gaming with Amiibo toys and Bowser was there and Mario was there and Princess Peach. Oh, yeah, I have it all figured out. They're not going to get me now, and your channel's gone once again. How does that make you feel, you piece of trash? What are you going to do now? <clears throat> are you going to go back to D-Read, your little uh, water boy, and be like, hey, can I get another number, please? I'm too much of a loser to figure out what, know how to do this number thing. Can I get a num another number? Hey, D-Read, you prick. Are you going to stop simping for Darius Truxton, your lover, or are you going to actually grow some balls and tell him to do it himself? What is it going to be, Mr. I'm a rapper, I listen to rap music, I'm over 40 wearing fitted in a hoodie, and I have a girlfriend that doesn't like my YouTube channel and what I do on my friggin' channel and all this crap. What are you going to do about it? Hey, Darius, you lost another channel, and there's nothing you can do about it but cry on the internet. <laughs> Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. You know, you have a... No, what's, what's James Campbell going to do now? Make a community post and be like, Oh, hey, guys, uh, don't worry. Your, your, your master Darius will be back for new videos. <laughs> Well, I had actually a, a very interesting, funny topic to talk to roast them on today. I'll do that tomorrow, but today let's talk about the channel's gone. That's the story of the night, is it? <laughs> the channel. <laughs> Another one of Darius. Darius is trying to grow a beard, trying to trying to trying to be masculine for the first time in his life. Let me go. So, let me go over some comments first. Dean TV, you moron! That guy was shot. <laughs> He got shot. I was friends with both of them. I was acquaintances with both of them, right? And that other guy got shot. So that's not something you could talk someone out of, you moron. This isn't a freaking wrestling shoot or wrestling work promotion where you go and you start doing your little promo in your little bingo hall wrestling for old people. This isn't that. This is real life, okay? God. One other comment said, oh, the... I forgot that one other comment said, the person taking the right turn has the right away. I forgot to mention I had the left turn signal. You know when you're at a red light and uh, you're gonna take a left and you get the left turn signal? I have the left turn signals. But then the people opposite are still taking the right. And I, I'm saying to that, why don't you guys just wait five seconds till all the left turn people are gone, right? Okay, what else said is, oh, funny comment. Let's talk about Darius the Loser. Oh, so, no, before that, uh, someone, someone with a channel, alt account channel name named uh, Game Chasers Official, uh, was like, "Hey, Slotham, check out the videos." And <laughs> that video made me laugh so hard. It's that AI, you know, that AI generated speech, uh, whatever. That lit. I'm telling you, that video made me laugh so for like two minutes straight. It was so funny. That one was so funny. Yeah, some AI generated stuff. I have a question to ask. Uh, <laughs> I have a question to ask the people that have been around longer than me. Do you think? Uh, do you think Afro Gamer Dude uh, or Radical Rick uh, listens to my videos? <laughs> do you? Do you think? Because the people who started the whole ranting about people was Afro Gamer Dude and Radical Rick, right? They were the first two to kind of do it. I wonder if those two listen to my videos. Who knows? Okay, then I saw another comment, some guy, uh, I think I think it was Darius Trucks and the Saint. You said that uh, Darius uh, Keith Elwood, the real Keith Elwood, aka Darius Truxton, 
he married someone in Final Fantasy XI, and then you said the girl got creeped out about him, and then like said he was a creep. Oh my God, I want to know the details of that story. Because yeah, I, I played Final Fantasy XI online. It's a good game. It's one of the best MMORPGs, in my opinion, is Final Fantasy XI. Uh, and yeah, you can get married in the game. But oh my God, Darius Truxton, the admitted insult, is such a loser that he is literally marrying people in video games. Like, look at this guy. Ursha Gaming, proposed with Amiibo Toys, loser. Married someone in a video game, and that girl said this guy's a creep and a loser. Stalked, uh, no, a crashed at Candace's place or whatever, and that girl was like, this guy's a loser. And then tried to hit on a single mom, Rachel, and that guy, and she said this guy's a creep. Like, oh my god, Darius, you just keep taking loss after loss in your life, and you are pathetic. Hey, Albert Menendez, you public masturbating piece of trash, aren't you the one that said that, uh... The, the, the Truxton army is 50 deep and you guys are on the winning side when you tried to call out Pong Show in your pathetic attempt of a video you said hey join the winning side Truxton army is the winning side oh really where's your leader now with his Yoshi channel <laughs> he got crashed and burned right to the ground didn't he thank god you know some of you people might listen to this and be like oh Yo, thank you, Slotham, for the work you do. Yeah, I appreciate it. But you know what? The real work, the real work that's being done are the people that are taking down his channels. So thank you, people, that whoever is doing that. And thank you, people, like, you know, the ones who make the alt account channels, no context, Darius Truxton, that compiled all that stuff, saved the videos. Thank you guys, right, for making, those are the important stuff. Having a record of how much, how pathetic Darius is. All I do is I just repeat the nonsense that's already been said and been proven back at it in the airwaves so yeah like just so yeah uh, what else uh, hey cyan razor cell what are you gonna do now your little leader your master Darius Truxton uh, his channel is gone what are you gonna do now huh oh my lord see someone like Dar uh, someone like cyan razor cell I feel sorry for your father. Why? Because your father lost two boys that are now girls. Your father has to deal with your mom who's just totally hormone, you know, switched to women. Like, I can, I can fully see what happened. Your mom convinced you, pressured you, not pressured you, just kind of egged you on like, yeah, yeah, if you feel like changing, if you feel like changing roles in your life, go ahead. It's okay, you can become a woman now, it's fine. And your dad's just sitting there sighing like, what the hell have I gotten into? Oh my God, I feel sorry for that guy. I feel sorry for your dad, Cyan. Just look at what you've become, some pathetic, disgusting, decrepit piece of trash on planet Earth. Look what you have become. You had everything. You had parents that are millionaires. You had parents that are super smart. Both your parents are super smart and creative. And they're millionaires. And look what you've done with you with your life. You turned into the biggest piece of trash known to mankind. Disgusting. And now you're a bigger piece of trash because your leader Darius Truxton has lost another channel. No more, no more seven-hour football streams, you know? Touching grass on his premium food don, watching the Steelers and the Ravens, or whoever. None of that anymore. Oh god. I heard someone in the comments say that A. Volp is smarter than, you know, he's a smarter. I agree. A. Volp is, uh, he's someone that can uh, do both sides of the army and the other side. <laughs> A. Volp is someone, I always knew A. A. Volp from the beginning was the smartest one there. So... <clears throat> yeah, I basically... Oh yeah, by the way, yeah, I was just actually eating... Um, I ate again Sicilian pasta, uh, rigatini, and I also ate a uh, baguette cut up into small pieces in spinach dip. So yeah, as I was as I was eating that, I was looking at my YouTube uh, the, the last YouTube video. I look in the comments, and I right there I saw I saw oh look who lost another channel the Yoshi channel's gone. I'm like oh something to talk about today on my drive. Great. Hey, a drive, Darius Truxton, a car, a drive. Have you been ever been behind the wheel in your life, you loser? 
besides the go-karts and bumper cars that you've probably been to in Marine Land. So yeah, apparently, one of Canadian Gamer's videos where he says that Darius Truxton uh, visits Marine Land frequently, because yeah, Marine Land is closer to Hamilton. Uh, so yeah, he probably visits Marine Land frequently. I don't know what the hell he's doing there, but that's what Canadian Gamer, and even Alpha Nerd said it. Thank God for Alpha Nerd, because he's the one that exposed so much about Darius Truxton. It said in the comments that Alpha Nerd also exposed how uh, Darius married someone in Final Fantasy XI, and that girl got creeped out. Thank God. Hey, Turbo Joey, next time you talk to uh, Alpha Nerd, ask him, would you ever come back and rant and, and, uh, rant and uh, trash Darius Truxton? Or is it because, I want to know if this is the reason, is it because you're both in Hamilton, like Alpha Nerd and uh, Darius is in Hamilton, you might bump into each other in the, in like, you know, outside at a Walmart or Tim Hortons, and it might be awkward. Is that the reason why you don't want to? I just want to know that, I just want to know that reason. Next time you talk to him, find out. If he, if he wants to, if he wants to explain why, and also ask him if he listens to my rants. <clears throat> so... Yeah, James Campbell, you 14 karat gold chain piece of trash, you fake reborn, you fake reborn Christian, using using the Christianity thing as a shield. Your 400 pound, your 400 pound Estella wife, that beached whale, almost as much, probably weighs as just as much as uh, Dean TV's uh, bisexual baby mama. Yeah, Dean TV, like you're just admitting that you knew she was bisexual. Like, that's disgusting. You're a loser. End of story. You're a loser, right? Like, okay, you're a failed wrestler, wrestling at bingo halls and friggin' backyard wrestling. Like, you're failed in every way. You're just admitting you're a loser. No wonder you hang out on that trash of a. Uh, on that trash stream. The, uh, the Keep It Real stream. No wonder you hang out there. Because you're surrounded by another a, a group of incels. You're, su you're surrounded by a group of trash people. It just makes you feel good that you're list you're sitting there with a friggin' before it was cyan razor cell, like the a whole mess of a, uh, of himself, just a trash person doing making all the right mo making all making all the wrong decisions in life. Of course, someone like cyan razor cell is not gonna like Andrew Tate because everything Andrew Tate says goes against your all all your decisions you made in your life. Of course you're not going to like it. And then he got uh, Albert Menendez, the a real man taking care of your ex-wife, taking care of your two daughters. Like you're surrounded on a keep it real stream with pieces of trash. So that's why Dean TV, you hang out there, makes yourself feel better. The only thing you got over those guys is like, yeah, you keep physically fit. That I give you, I'll always give you credit on that. You, you are strong, you are physically fit. Like, wrestling isn't easy. That's the only thing you have over them. Other than that, it's the same garbage life decisions. Probably Dean TV has the best job out of all of them anyways. You got Cyan Razor Cell, freaking a dog sitter. Just trash. Why is it? Why is it always... Why is it always the richest parents and the best parents have the most trash kids that they raise? Why is that? Why does that always happen? I've noticed that in my life, you know, the parents that have to struggle, the parents that have to struggle and make something of themselves, they have kids and they're trying to raise their kids in a good way. They have the best kids and the, and the parents that have everything already made, like Cyan's parents, millionaires, doctors, super smart, super intelligent, super creative, spawn the most garbage children I have ever seen in my life. Like a disgusting, no, bad hygiene, bad decisions, trash person that I've ever seen. Why, why does that always happen? It, it does, because Cyan Razor Cell is a piece of trash. That pathetic attempt with those AI-generated speeches, it actually made me laugh. That, that literally made me laugh. It was funny. <clears throat> yeah, oh yeah, so let's get back to Darius. Darius Truxton. 
He's just he's gonna come home from his dead end job today. And he's gonna be like, oh man, not again. Okay, time to smoke more weed and and cry about it and cry on the internet a little bit more. What are you gonna do, Darius? You gave up already trying to bury me after video three and I'm just getting started. I can never stop. It doesn't stop. I can never, never stop. That broken dreams, what a piece of trash. One of the comments, he's like, you're so obsessed that you're talking about Darius during your daily task. I was exercising. <laughs> it doesn't, it's not hard to talk while you're doing something. It's called multitasking. That's the whole point is that I'm doing these videos while doing something else. Therefore, I'm not wasting any time. Like right now I'm driving. So I might as well pick up the phone and record how much a piece of trash a Truxton army is. It's not that hard to do. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. The fun, there's a funny, the funny video. I can't remember whose channel it was, channel it was where it was like, Canadian g gamer in his command center. <laughs> that's the that's the originating video of oh man oh man oh man oh man. Oh man. <laughs> that was a funny video. I can't remember whose channel that was. <clears throat> yeah. So now that Darius Truxton uh, lost another channel, his oh his uh, hundred subscribers Yoshi channel, he's gonna make another video now saying I'm done with YouTube. I can't stand it anymore on YouTube. I can't do this and that. And then he's gonna make another video saying, come to my backup channel. I made a backup channel. He's gonna be high on Coke again, and then in his kitchen telling people to go to his backup channel. Jesus. Jesus. Oh yeah, Pong Show, I saw your uh, video, that the, like the hour long video where you're talking about the Amico. Yeah, that was good. Just keep doing stuff like that. And uh, you said yourself, oh, you talk slow, you're not good for this. If you make the videos yourself, coming from your own channel, it's fine. But if you're on a podcast with someone else, then yeah, that might be an issue where you talk slow and you can't really get your thoughts together. So don't go on anyone else's channel. Just stick to your own and make those kind of videos because people still listen. As you see, people listen, people talk to you in the comments. People want to hear your stories about the Amico. <clears throat> yeah, so let's talk about Oliver Menendez again. I, you know, I can never get enough trashing how much, how garbage and degenerate these people are. I can't get enough. I can just keep going. <clears throat> so Albert Menendez said in one of his previous videos that he was like, oh, someone stole his uh, Santa hat and his uh, turban. Well, what do you expect? If your house is the park bench and some hobo is going to come along, he's definitely going to steal your things. You sleep under a park bench with your blue sleeping bag. You take showers in the Walgreens sink. You drink the toilet water because you're dehydrated. You wear the same damn black uh, dress shirt. I don't know. I don't know how long you've had that for or what thrift store you got that out of, but you wear that same stupid black shirt. You're probably wearing the same shirt every day to your stupid job, which apparently you said you don't have anymore. It could be bait so that it could be bait so that um, you don't lose it. You never know. I'm telling you, he might still have that server job at wherever it was that I can't remember the place of the restaurant. Hey, Albert, when's the last time you talked to your daughters, you loser? There's no need. You don't even need to talk to them anymore. They have a new daddy in town. They have a new daddy taking care of them. It's okay, Albert. You can keep publicly masturbating wherever you want. It's fine. Keep getting a misdemeanor. You still have to pay your $285 fine, which you haven't. <clears throat> don't worry about it. You don't have to talk to your two daughters that you don't have custody of anymore because you're a loser. You don't even have a place to stay <clears throat> except the park bench. James Campbell is going to make a community post. Guys, Darius is okay. He's doing just fine. He will be back soon with another channel. Don't you guys worry. Truxton is okay. <laughs> that's going to be that's going to be James's community post. Just talking about complete gar James Campbell is I'm going to do a video one day, The 7 Sins of the Devil. And I'm going to talk about how each one of those sins 
you you Truxton Army are breaking, and including you, James Campbell, you're breaking one of the seven sins of the devil too. I'm going to make a video about that one time. So, what else? So, yeah. Is, is Broken Dreams really Murray J... Uh, Murray J N 8 Or Murray NJ N 8 Is it really him? Because, dude, Broken Dreams, if that's you... Why are you even uh, trying to beef with me? You are the You are the most overweight, disgusting looking piece of trash I have ever seen. Look at you. And you're trying to compare with me? You're trying to compare with me about life decisions and what to do in life? Look at you. You're garbage. Eating cupcakes all day. This guy's saying that exercising is a daily task. Like, you know nothing about exercising. When's the last time you exercised? Wow. Why is it just the most garbage worst people that are trying to uh, argue with me and trying to bury me it's just ridiculous it's just I knew right away yo Darius what are you gonna do are you gonna make another response video to me are you are you tired yet I saw your last video about the the 8 bit Eric uh, whatever the woke thing like dude you lost your whole mojo like you're you're tired your your brain's so slow look all that weed has turned your brain into mush you can't even speak fast anymore you have no energy when you talk you're so limp you don't even have a girlfriend by choice aka can't land a girlfriend like what are you doing with your life your parents must be so sad and mad that this is what's happened to their one and only son that they thought that can carry on their lineage in this world, right? That's what they thought. But nope. Darius is some loser sitting at home on his uh, premium futon, smoking weed, watching football at his dead-end job, trying to make something of his YouTube channel, which has failed again miserably because that's been taken down again. Darius. <laughs> Darius song. The Darius song. See, the thing is, is that Dazed Gaming, right? The Hammock Man. He wanted to bury Darius like this, but he he couldn't, right? Because he wishes he stayed anonymous. But the key, the key to burying these losers, if you're anonymous, right? It's just to keep going. Never stop. It's easy. How hard is it to talk about how much, how trash someone else is? It actually, in a sense, it releases stress. It's a good stress reliever doing this. After this, I go home. I'm in a good. I'm in a good mood. I'm happy. I do some fun stuff. Like you know, it's fun trashing these people. All right, let's see. Yeah, let's talk about how uh, Darius lost his channel. In the comments, I want to hear all. I want to see all the funny comments you can. All right, I'm out. Peace.